And first at 11, parents in Hamilton County continue to speak out against the Carmel Clay School District's diversity, equity, and inclusion efforts. Yeah, WRTV's Cameron Riddle explains what those for and against the initiatives had to say outside tonight's school board meeting and what the district wants parents to remember. Diversity, equity, and inclusion is an initiative that has become part of regular trainings in corporate offices, nonprofits, and schools. In Hamilton County, leaders of Carmel Clay Schools have followed suit, vowing to make the state's eighth largest school district a place that welcomes all types of students and staff. That's welcome news to local activist Ashton Spilker. A large percentage of employers say that having an employee that's educated on issues of diversity is important to them. So we're preparing our, our students for the world that they're about to head out to. In a statement to the district's families, Carmel's new diversity, equity, and inclusion officer, Terry Roberts Leonard, described the district's DEI mission as a way to foster an environment where all students and staff are supported, respected, and valued while being safe and heard. The district's website explains its DEI efforts as a series of trainings for school staff in hopes of providing them with a better understanding of the different cultures and experiences of their students and co-workers. Carmela Sparrow can't understand why anyone would be against that. I see DEI work and racial reconciliation a lot like a good relationship. Anytime you've had any relationship where you've had any strain in the relationship, you can't just brush over the issue and move on. You have to talk through the issue. Ahead of a Monday night school board meeting, a group of parents protested the district's DEI initiatives, claiming Carmel Clay Schools is teaching students critical race theory, which is a belief shared by many civil rights scholars and activists that racism is a part of everyday life for people of color. Alvin Louie is a concerned parent who says he moved his family away from California to get away from DEI initiatives and critical race theory. Uh, speaking as Asian, I'll tell you this, as a, uh, my family's Chinese. As a, fa as a father of a young uh, family, I've never lost a single minute of sleep to white supremacy. It's never been a problem. But I've lost a lot of sleep to this ideology because it teaches, again, what I said earlier, it teaches my daughter that her only characteristics in life that matters is that she's Asian and female. Carmel Clay Schools continue to stress they do not teach critical race theory and their DEI initiatives for staff have nothing to do with what students are being taught in the classroom. Carmel Clay Schools does not teach critical race theory for the 1619 Project, nor are either of these topics found in Carmel Clay School curriculum. In our Carmel Clay Schools, we teach character counts, and kindness matters. Cameron Riddle, WRTV. Well, Carmel Clay School's Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion Initiative was not on tonight's school board meeting agenda, but parents used the public comment section to share their thoughts. Parents also spoke out last month after the January hiring of the district's first DEI officer.